So first I'm going to show you and explain how the shield works, meaning the safety settings, which are very important in VR chat. So you open, press escape on desktop, open your small menu, click the little cogwheel down here and expand up here and change to the safety. And now we're going to see this screen. So what does this mean? You can change presets from maximum security, meaning you're not going to see much of anything to normal or none, which means you're going to see everything for everyone, which is quite dangerous, but some people like it generally in danger in their lives. So why not? I'm not judging anyone. So I'm going to go to custom, which allows me to change these settings. And I'm going to explain what each of these mean. So first I'm going to, you can see these like ranks, which goes from visitor, new user, user, known user, trusted user and friends, which means friends have specific special settings. Uh, that doesn't relate to the rank system and you can change what things you see for each ranks in, uh, individually this is based on a belief that trusted users who's been who've been in the game for quite a while can be trusted more than uh, visitors who, has, who have been there for a couple hours and might just want to troll you know so first you have voice meaning you can disable or enable if you're gonna hear the person's microphone, meaning if I disable this, I'm not gonna hear any visitor talk at all. This means, do I wanna see avatars of uh, visitors? Yes or no, I can disable them, so I'm not gonna see any avatars or I'm gonna see avatars by default. You can also disable or enable their user icons and all their emojis, including the custom ones. You can also disable or enable the audio that comes from their avatar, avatar, which can be sound effects, music, and all the sounds in their, on their avatar. I can also enable or disable lights and particles of their avatar, which is quite good to disable because these things can crash you, unfortunately. I can also enable or disable shaders, which can also be a good idea because shaders can, uh, you know, crash you or also cause headaches. They can be splatter across your whole screen and all that. So for visitors, I would recommend to turn this off. And also you can turn on and off custom animations of avatars. So you can also turn this on and off. And you can see every trust rank has separate settings. So usually for friends, you turn everything on. And for known users and trusted users, you can set this really high for users I'll leave that to your discretion and for visitors and new users you might want to be a bit cautious.